right, it's Roger with iGadget Geek, and I have another accessory review. This time it is the iHome alarm clock radio for Android. As you can see, I have my Galaxy S3 on the actual dock, and it is charging my phone. Now, this does retail for $49.99 on AT&T's website. Now, of course, with this clock radio, it is really an interesting design. You're able to have your Android device up here and charging while you sleep. Now it's not going to work the same as a lot of other docks for other phones. The audio output is not going to actually run through the dock connector. I'm going to go ahead and rotate this here. Now if you want to play audio through the included speakers, you're going to need to use an actual cable. So as you can see it has a port on the inside for a 3.5 millimeter cable. So you want to plug that into the top of your phone. Now once you do that, you're going to want to come down here to mode and you're going to want to put it on the actual auxiliary mode which shows a little music symbol right here and then you're going to come up to your phone and go ahead and play you some music And of course you have your volume up and down on the radio itself on the very top display. Alright, what I want to do now is go ahead and take a close-up view here of the actual iHome dock itself. I'm going to go ahead and grab my S3 and get it on out of the way. Let's take a look around here on the very front. You have a nice numbered display here with your time. And of course it will show a PM if it is PM. And it does have a dimmer on the very top control right here. So you can dim the actual numbers and you can completely turn them off. So at night if the light from this display is bothering you're able to take those numbers and completely dim them. So it's kinda nice to have that control over the actual display so if you sleep somewhere and it's pretty dark and that light would bother you, you're able to turn it off. Of course you have a nice snooze button for your alarm. You have an alarm, you have a uh, sleep button, your volume up and down, and of course your, your mode would be for AM or FM. So we'll go ahead and turn it on. As you can see, I have it on FM. Then you have volume up and down. Then, of course, you have your mode here for tuning. You can tune it manually. Now, this is not going to be, by any means, some huge-sounding stereo system. It's designed primarily as an alarm clock radio. Um, it will do a pretty good job. It's definitely going to play better than the speakers that are built into your phone. But it's not designed to be a huge audio station. If you're wanting something like that, there's a lot of other things on the market. This really kind of feels a pretty unique niche. It's going to be a device where you can set it on your end table, have your alarm clock, your little radio, and charge your Android device at the same time. Now one of the neat things they've done with this is they've allowed you this little slide here that moves left and right for the dock. Now what that allows you to do is to accommodate multiple versions of Android phones, whether it be like my Galaxy S3 with the port on the bottom right there, no problem. But some of the Android devices actually have those ports, you know, up here on the side. Well, you could slide this to one side, set your phone in there and still charge. So you may be asking, well, wait a minute, I use a case and it may not fit right there. Well, that's where this dock really comes in handy. This top piece is removable. And once you remove it, basically here on the inside, let me get all this stuff out of the way, you're presented with a USB charging port and a 3.5 millimeter audio in. Now you do not actually even have to use the dock if you do not want to. You can just use this here as a USB output to charge your device. So if you use say an OtterBox or something like that, you can get you a longer USB cable. Like here I have just a standard USB to micro USB. We can go ahead and plug that on in. Remove the one that came with the clock radio snap this back into place and then you can actually take your phone and set it next to your clock radio and charge it that way so this will work even if you have one of those big bulky cases to protect your phone gives you a lot of great options and I really like the fact that they thought about cases and accessories when they designed this clock radio it's definitely going to be a good little clock radio it's going to do something most clock radios don't and that is charge your phone now this has been my full review of the iHome for Android, and this has been Roger with iGadgetGeek.